What? What's going on? Are you good? Hey, are you good? Hey. Oh gosh. Sir, are you Oh, it's the same one. Okay, okay, okay. I'm not sucking it out of you, but I got mad cures for you, so. Yeah, I know. What's wrong with you? You gotta be prepared. Are you good? No worries. Just Ashley. Me neither. Well. I best be get back to town. Uh, gonna eat a uh, uh, stiff one tonight. <sighs> well, well, you well. Getting another out. <laughs>Seriously, though, the guy got bit second time, and I'm the same person who saved him. Lover of ladies here, like my video, share my video, leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys. But most importantly, subscribe to the channel, that way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me. And hit that notification button as well, so you know when I upload my videos. Hello, we meet again. I've been away for so long, but I'm just Hello, glad to be back. Man. Of course, I got you. Here. How you been? You What's new with you? Last we spoke, sir. You didn't run far enough. How you know it's me? How you know it's me? You can't even see me. How do you know it's me? Huh, interesting. I guess he can sense me. Alright, just be careful. Don't do anything foolish, you hear me? I like seeing you around. No, Brother Brodus, you... My friend. You there. What, me? Listen, I just came here to get myself a nice bath, shave my face, and all that stuff. So what do you want? What do you want? Do I look like a coward to you? I, mean, I don't know. Obviously I do because I look like that milksop there, but tis no matter. Can you help? Maybe. See, even he is sick of hearing your nonsense, you afterthought of a child. I apologize, sir, for his smell. Why don't we come back here to somewhere more conducive to displays of utter gallantry and deep... Seated inadequacy. Well, what did you have in mind? Shoot a bottle off my head. Like William What? Tell. This is getting silly. Very silly. The man is a moron. Shoot one off mine instead. Yeah, I'm the brave one. I'm not scared. Uh, I'm a good shot, but... I won't even flinch. I don't want to hurt you, boys. Oh, I can't lose. Either I'll prove my masculinity or die Your what? spared his company. Come, sir, please. Okay, then. Am I getting paid for this? For Listen, this nonsense? Just make sure everyone knows you asked me to do this. Of course, of course, of course. You boys are ridiculous. I can't believe I'm doing this. You ready? So, ready? should I do... Dead eye and dead eye. Let's go. Next. <laughs> that was fun. What was? I feel like we didn't even do anything. You of didn't. You didn't. We all know you're hardly sentient at all. Another round, smaller bottles, sir. Please. Are you kidding me? Uh, I don't know. Please, this creature is unbearable. He needs silencing. These boys are so bored. Are you gonna witness this or not, ma'am? Because I'm not trying to be labeled as a serial killer. Anyways, so we got here one, and we got here two. 
I'll stand on one leg. Me Are you kidding me? Shooting, sir, and this time you kill the beast. He emerged fully formed from the swamps. Helen, silence, you blackguard, sir. Shoot the wretch. I guess I'm actually doing this, huh? Shoot away, sir. My bottle is Hold still. Hold still. One and two. Now do one while I hop. Do one while I turn somersaults. Uh, shoot me. Oh, give me the gun. Let me shoot him. Huh? For all mankind. Uh, I think me and the lady have had enough. Oh, I don't blame you, sir. This man's tongue, I would run too if I could. Here, for your skills and talents. Money? Hey. Hell yeah. Brother, I am going to walk Helen home. Don't follow us. She has an elderly aunt, and I fear the sight of you could finally finish her off. Helen, is this creep bothering uh, you? You two, come along. Oh, no, there aren't two. There's me and the lizard man. Please, my angel, do not aggregate us both together. They are so weird. They are so weird. I got a dollar sixty-nine for that. Are you kidding me? A dollar sixty-nine for dealing with those two losers. Anyways, let me go ahead and take a nice little bath because I need it. Who the hell is getting bullied? Who's getting bullied? Oh. What the hell? What the hell? You pushing me, boy? Huh? You pushing me? Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Bet. Bet. Ooh. Bye. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. You done? You done? You done? Great. Now I got two witnesses and now I need to leave. But you know what? It's okay. I'll kill any and every Adriscal I see in this town and anywhere else. Let me get my hat and leave. All right, come on, baby, let's go. Let's go. I am leaving. Uh, no, sir, I'm not gonna stop. See ya. Not really, but whatever. Come on, baby, let's go. Come on. Let's go. I don't regret killing those Driscoll boys. They deserve it, so I really don't care. You better leave me alone before I kill you, law man. I'm serious. I'm trying to- Ooh, you ass. You ass. Okay, cool. I- I see you. Come on, I can't even- Let's go, right here, right here. There you go. There you go. There you go, that should teach you a lesson. That should teach you a lesson. Leave me alone. Leave me alone! That's all I have to say. Leave me alone before I kill more. I guess my bounty increased or something. I don't know. They need to stop and leave me alone. I did that boy a favor by saving him from the Idriscals. I really don't care. Anyways, on to... You know what? I'm gonna talk to Dutch. No, actually, I'm gonna go find Sadie. I don't wanna see Dutch for a bit. I really don't. Oh, get out! What? Move. Oh, man, this sucks. This sucks. Look at this. Look at these assholes here trying to kill me off. Some nerve. Anyways, run, Arthur, run! Run! This is some mini adventures right here. Come here. Right here. One and two. There you go. There you go. Oh, that is not good. Oh, my goodness. This is horrible. I'm just trying to have a nice little quiet time away from the gang, but it seems like trouble will always go and find me. You jerks. 
Arthur, run. Run, Arthur! Run! Hold on, let me go and see if I can eat something quickly. Here you go. Ooh, I am literally at my wit's end here. Come on, kidney bone. Uh, kidney uh, beans, let's go. Am I good? Another one. Am I good? Alright. Alright, first of all, where you at? Hold on, dead eye. Right here, chewing tobacco. Oh, I see them. I see them running. Alright, I'm ready. Come on. Come on. Thank you. We done, right? Another one. Right there. Okay. Another beans. Let's go. I'm eating all my food. I see them. I see them. Right there. Boom! Come on. Am I not shooting them? Right here, this one. So I'm done, right? No one following me? Hold on. Where my horse at? Wow, these guys were really trying to kill me. Ha! Huh. And yet, look who's still standing, jerks. I ate enough food to give me enough energy to fight back. Nice. Yeah, this is definitely a nice little filler episode, I'm not gonna lie. But it's a nice little change compared to the usual mission after mission after mission. What, another one? Hold on. Okay. Say less. So, one. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, I'm causing trouble. I am causing so much trouble, I really don't care. Ugh! Right here, right here, right here. Come on. Got that. Right here, and right here. Boom. Come on. There you go. Come on, there you go. Nice. Who's a witness? Right here. There you go. No witness. Come on. I am fighting everyone at this point. Excuse me. There you go. Go. Okay. Now, I was dead broke before these bastards grabbed me, but I can tell you something juicy. My way of thanking you. There's tell me. South of Rhodes, Pop and his son. Nothing fancy, but word is he's gathering quite the little nest for himself. Okay. Really? Thank well, you. Okay. Thanks again, Mister. I like a nice little robbery yeah, tip. Move. Only a matter of time before more come. Let me see what I can get. Two dollars. This is a nice hat. Let me swap it. Woohoo! Cowboy baby. Let me see what's in this body right here. That's right. Robbing from the authority. I love it. Hey, boy. All right, let's go and get Sadie and see what we're going to do about yeah. the Pinkertons. Arthur, you okay? I finally got to the city to see Sadie, and I'm over here just... Arthur. Arthur? Oh no, he's about to pass out! Arthur! Who the hell is robbing me? Oh. Hey. Mr. 
Mister, are you okay? No, I'm not. Mister, are you okay? I think something are bad is okay, really mister? happening to me. Mister, you don't look so good. Let's get you to a doctor. Dang. Ooh. Okay. You know, you're an angel, sir. You could have robbed me. You could have killed me. You could have took advantage of me. Yeah, look at you helping me find a doctor. Whoa, is that... Am I coughing blood? Wow, I am tweaking. I must have caught something from that jungle. Go on. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. I must have caught something from the jungle. I really don't. Miss, I need help. Can I help you? Uh, I, I need a doctor. Oh, uh, just one second, sir. Thank you. Miss. I have money, too, so... Miss. I'm able to pay the deductible if I have any insurance. Look at him, he's wheezing. Mister, I need some help. And so it seems. <coughs> and that's Dr. Mister to you. Okay, damn, relax. Sorry, I was joking. Your friend, I don't mean nothing, but you got money? Yeah. Yes, I do. I mean, before I start treating you, because I got a family. Yeah, I understand. Here, that did. Uh, sure. Thank you. Now, what's wrong? I mean, what appear to be the symptoms? Well, I think you've heard them and I'm coughing. Uh, is there any blood? Sometimes. Uh -huh. Okay, now here. Breathe. Again. Let me see your tongue. Now say ah. How bad is it? What is it? It's not good news. Well, I guess that. You got tuberculosis. TB? I'm sorry for you, son. It's a hell of a thing. What do you mean? You're real sick. You... It's a progressive disease. And you'll be... Now, the best thing is rest. Getting somewhere warm and dry and taking it easy. Now, is that possible? Sure, I can just take my winters in my country club in California. No, it's not possible. Well, like I said, I, I'm real sorry. Yeah, well. Yeah, oh, wait, wait. Uh, let me get you a little bit more energy today. Did you even clean that that needle? That rusty needle? Ugh. Thank you. Ten dollars. That's cheap. TB, huh? I know back in the day there wasn't any cure for it. Oh, Arthur. Since there's no cure, he's gonna get worse. And since he's gonna get worse... He's dying. When I first played through this game... I went through the same situation, Arthur getting TB. And honestly... We can't change what's done. We can only move on. It broke my heart so much that I just stopped playing this game. I've never finished it. Now that I'm playing it again, you have it in you. I can tell. I know I'm gonna finish it, but it's gonna really break my heart just watching this man slowly dying. It really is. I didn't have a choice. He was good, and he did good. Oh, Arthur. I'm so sorry, man. You... You don't deserve this. You really don't. You don't deserve this. I'm 
understand if you don't want to help me, but... But... I think of you often. Now Arthur is living on borrowed time. And once that borrowed time runs out... A deer? Wait! Hold on! Wait! That deer is gone. Hello. Y you are sick. While sick, you will only gain the benefit from consuming wherever. Great. Great. I'm dying. Where's Sadie? <coughs> oh shit! Look at me spitting blood. Guess they know now we ain't in the city. Who, Mr. Milton's friends? Yeah, they've had patrols out ever since you boys disappeared. Well, at least you're alive. For now. For now, yeah. What happened in... Um... Wama? Yeah. <coughs> Nothing nice. What happened to Dutch? Because he seems... I don't know. Seems as... What began happening in Blackwater began happening... Years ago, maybe. A slow decline, I guess. What do you mean? I ain't quite sure. What happened here? I started gathering people up as best I could after you boys left. And John, you know that part. Yeah, he's in jail. I, uh, Dead. Hell, we got Lenny's body out as well. Mm. I the morgue and buried them together. Lenny. Lenny didn't deserve that, man. In fact, it should have been me. I don't care what anyone says. It should have been me. Sadie, I'm dying. I hope you know that. I know you can see in my face, and I can see in your face, too. So, but... what's your plan here? Well, I figure before we do anything, we need to make sure John's even still at this prison. And how do we do that? We need to get up high enough to get a proper look at the place. What? It's on an island, ain't it? Unless you're planning on learning how to fly. That's exactly what we're gonna do. What? I found us a hot air balloon. You ain't serious. Now, the pilot, or whatever you call him, he thinks we're just in it for a lesson. Bit of a tour. <laughs> He's quite the character. I think you'll like him. You know... I'm impressed. You really stepped things up, ain't you? Hey, we didn't know if you was even coming back. I Don't didn't even know either. Real hard. I bet it did. Heron's gone falling fully into the bottle. Strauss is a bag of nerves. Swanson, well, Swanson's actually gone and cleaned up his act. So I guess it ain't all gone to shit. I'm just happy you boys were able to find us. Javier said he got the letter I left at the post office. That was a good idea. Until the Pinkerton showed up. Oh, by the way, I've been hunting O'Driscoll boys. So have I. And two of the sons of bitches at a campsite last week. What? Oh, she a beauty, ain't she? From here on the ground, yes. Oh. Mr. Bullard? Hmm. Mr. Bullard. Ah, Mrs. Adler. It's good to see you. Good to see you. Ah, uh, this is my friend I told you about, Mr. Morgan. Ah, yes, Arturo Bullard. At your service, sir. At your service. Arthur Morgan. Well, it's a nice, fresh day for flying, sir. A day like today, and Icarus would have made it across the sea. Ha, ha, ha. Have you ever flown before, sir? No, oh, I have not. It's quite a thing. Not an air balloon. Now, put these on and hop in. Well, ain't she coming? Ah, well, women can't fly, sir. Are you what? insane? Are you oh, kidding me? No, sir, does terrible damage to them, to their How? vapors. Vapors? Knew about that, That's a stupid. Like Mrs. Adler? <laughs> Heavens above or below. Ah. That's the most guy? stupidest I'll thing I'll I've ever heard. Get on. <sighs> yeah, great. Are you sure about this? Certain, sir. Quite certain. Mrs. 
Let us away. Wish us luck. I've only crashed twice. Now, what? On that rope and hope for the best. You crashed twice, and you think, oh gosh, Sadie. Sadie, I'm gonna get you for this. Right. Time to catch a few vapors of our own. It's a little overcast, but I'm expecting some good wind once we're high enough. We should still have some decent views over the river. All right, so it's to be coarse, but on the subject of ablutions, liquids over the side, solids, do your utmost to levy the situation until we land. Okay, Mr. Bullard. I had a client once who fell foul to a rotten oyster on the ascent. A decidedly harrowing experience for all involved. How high are we going? going sir. We need to get up above the clouds. That high? Are you sure? Stunning up there, you'll have seen nothing like it. I would be scared shitless to be on a hot air balloon. Seriously though, how high are we going? Clouds. We're actually going this high, huh? Oh no, this is not. This is. This ain't the vibes. My God, yes, heavenly indeed. Quite remarkable, isn't it? I mean, I'm not gonna lie. This is beautiful. Okay. This particular vessel is state of the art, sir. Imported from Europe. We'll find more than a couple of these on this side of the pond. So long as it works. Okay, we're getting a oh. little high now. Alright. Sorry. My bad. Cause you know, if it's too high, I bet this balloon would pop and we'll fall to the ground for sure, you know. But wow, look at the view in here. This sure is I bet she did. She did, did she? This is amazing. Look at this. Look at the cloud. So fluffy. My bad. How beautiful. I wonder how much she paid for this. It's beautiful. Sorry, my bad. I gotta admit, this is beautiful. You know what? I'm glad Sadie convinced me to do this. Especially since I'm dying. Who knows when I'll be able to get another chance like this again, you know? Ah, that's better. Look, we can see for miles now. I see a train. I see swamps. Thanks, but I don't want more eggs. I'm good. I feel like if I eat an egg, I'll be really gassy. So I'm good. Where is this prison that John's in? That's where I'm trying to find the place. Oh, John. Please descend uh, a little. There isn't enough wind at this height. It's it's descending, sir. Just oh, give me a moment. Of course. I prefer slightly more feminine attire on a lady, but variety is the very spice of life, as they say. Or is it though? Did you know they locked up the man who wrote that in a mental asylum? Did they? Wow, crazy. Personally, with me, I don't care if a woman is feminine or masculine, as long as their personality meshes up with mine. Well, well, well. That is funny that you mention it. 
Why not? I want to see. That's what I mean. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.